Motorola's App Center is a tool that will allow you to lock out the whole OS on the Windows Mobile device. It can be configured uh, to only allow the application that you choose to have running or give the user's option of running. Um, it is configured by logging in with the uh, administrative password. So right now you see there are certain applications that are available. Um, you can have it show different things. You can have it show connectivity. You can have it show wireless settings, volume, signal, um, different items. You can have it uh, appear with uh, default ways. You can put in custom custom titles on the, the top of the screen. Um, you can have the when they tap on the radio icon, you can have it do different things, um, different options. Logging is available for applications that may be closing that you didn't want to close. Under admin, you're able to create a new password, browse. These are the directories in which App Center will go out and search for applications that you would want to use. Um, close is a nice option and the fact that there's an executable that you don't want to ever close or you want to always close you can list it here it will always be shut down there are several other items you can do is to hide SIPs in terms of security um, disabling memory card Bluetooth active sync however you would want to secure the device as well as finding ways to um, work with the phone in terms of uh, what the phone is able to do and what not as well as some other settings so we'll save that and if we say we're going to add a new program for example this will go and search those directories that we defined earlier so it's going out to find out what applications are available and let's just say for an example we want to run uh, Internet Explorer as an approved application so Internet Explorer comes up we will hit the Save button so as you can see there are things here let's say we also wanted an application that uh, will run on the device but in essence we don't really want the users to have access to it but the device needs it in order to run so let's just say Adobe Reader needs to be running but we don't want the users to actually be able to see it um, there's the approved executable for Adobe Reader under Windows um, we're allowing the title to happen but here we're gonna say we're gonna hide it from the user so other options here you can we're always hiding the start menu um, but uh, if you wanted to add um, for an application hide the soft input panel you can always check that um, so option two um, really allowing people to do things but in terms of uh, uh, this in this case we're not going to be running Adobe so the users can see it You can also use App Center to start application so if we chose to start Adobe we can say we want to start the application when App Center starts we want to stop it when it start when it stops again um, you can also only allow it to run if a certain IP is on the device or a required SSID so what we're going to do is we're going to say save and it takes us back to our screen and then under tools we're going to log admin logout so as you can see Internet Explorer is available calculators available but Adobe Reader is not so your users are only allowed those applications that are here so once Windows comes up um, it'll come up and uh, they'll have the ability to use IE once they're done they go back here's what they're allowed it's a nice lockdown tool